good morning good people welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new welcome back if you're not let's go back some so today i just want to give you some tips and some benefits on waking up early um i know it can be hard especially if you're not a morning person it can be very very hard which i am a morning person always have been but when I became a mom, several years into it, I was like, okay, I'm going to have to do something different, you know, in order to get everything I need. So I started waking up every morning at 5.30. Sometimes I wake up at 5 or 4 30 um and i just stay up <laughs> but there are some benefits to waking up early so let's talk about that so if i look down look at my notes <laughs> so the first one i have is being productive so getting up early it gives you a lot of time to do things that you need to get done especially you don't have a little one or little ones mommy 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 you know you can get up you can tidy the house you can get some things done uh that you want done for yourself you can do that so i just feel getting up early i am more productive in my day um so I, I try not to go to bed with the house a wreck. Mainly every night, I, I straighten up before I go to sleep. But if, say, like Azaria's room, like if I'm up and I see, I'll go ahead and I'll straighten it up, tidy it up. I try not to because I'm trying to instill in her responsibility, but we're working on it. <laughs> so, number two. Happiness, y'all. If you get up early, especially if the sun is out, I mean, if it's gloomy, you can still be happy. But when the sun is out and you're up and you can watch the sunrise, it's like a calming and refreshing feeling, I'm telling you. Um, it's just like, oh, okay, you know, yes, let's get this day going. It motivates you, it really does. Um, it, I don't know. It's just something about the sun coming through the windows and I'm up and I'm like, I'm ready to go. You know, let's get this day going. So with being happy also comes being stress-free. So you're not rushing. I get up. I have my coffee every morning. I have my coffee and I also have a bottle of water every morning. Drink your water, y'all. But I get up, I have my coffee, I have my water. I can sit down. I have time to watch what I want to watch, you know, without being interrupted or without it being something like what that I can't watch with Azaria, you know. And I'm not a night person. I will fall asleep. See what I'm saying? So I can watch what I want to watch and not be worried about, okay, you said some bad words. So oh, Zari's right there. So, you know, that. Or um, I can take my time and get my mind together for the work day. Because you need that too. Because you don't want to go into work all intensified you know you you're tense you know you're rushing you're stressed because you're rushing you know kids you got to get them ready get them out the door get them to school on time so it's just easier to just get on up and you know just take your time you can set out the clothes some people set them out the night before but me i do mine during the day in the morning because I might not want to wear that that I picked out last night. So I just 
wait till in the morning and pick out my clothes, pick out Zari's clothes. Well, she's getting to the age where she won't pick out her own clothes. But I don't have, I'm not rushed, if you see what I'm saying. So the next one, number five, four. Four, girl, slow your road. Number four, um, organized. Getting up early can help you be more organized because you can sit out and you can actually plan out your day. Uh, a lot of times plans don't go according to how you plan them, but it's that structure of knowing what you have to do. So my day, I get up at 5.30 and I get Azari up at 6.30, sometimes 7. So I have an hour to an hour and 30 minutes to myself just to get what I need done or just to sit and be with Monica, you know? Um, I have time to get all my things together, get my purse together. If I brought work home for the night or something like that, I have time to get that together, everything. And I'm not, uh, okay, where's this at? Do I have this? Do I have that? I already, I, I have time to get it together because <laughs> you're going to need it. Um, so it helps you with organization. I, I, I am a very structured person. I'm a very routine person. Um, I do change my routine, especially when it comes to like how I go to work, how I come home, what time I leave. And that's just coming from working in law enforcement. But I, I'm very routine and structured. And Azaria is like that. If she gets off of her routine, it's like, oh, she's out of whack. So it, it helps with that routine. It helps you to be organized and to know. She knows, okay, if mommy gets me up at 7, I have till about 7.10, 7.15 to eat my breakfast and get myself in the restroom get cleaned up so we can be out of the house by 7.30, 7.40. And she'll, she keeps her phone on her and she looks at that time. It's re, she's been routine ever since she was born. So, um, And number five, this is the big one. Number five, you have time for yourself. This is time for self-care. I know sometimes when I get up early, I'm like, okay, well, let me do a hairstyle that I wouldn't normally do. Or I do my nails. I paint my nails, put my press-ons on, paint my toes. It's just that time. Or I can just take me a hot shower and not worrying about anyone busting through the door. It's only us right now. Who busts my person? But it's only Azari and I, so I had that time to myself. I can do what I want to do. I can just sit here. I can fall back to sleep if I want to. It's just spend that time with yourself. Get to know yourself. Um, and th that's really what I love because when Azari gets up, it's, you know, she hits the ground running hard, y'all. And, and she goes 24-7. So, me having that time to myself is wonderful. Because um, she thinks when she goes to bed, I have to go to bed. She thinks it's my bed too. Uh, uh, if I don't lay down with her, this girl, she fights that sleep. She'll be up all night if I don't go to sleep. But that's another, that's another video. But yes, yeah, self-care. Take time for yourself relax you can do meditation you can do exercise um that's what i would do a lot when i was working out i need to start back working out but hey it's okay but you have time to exercise meditate do yeah try it please try it i'm telling you you will put it in your routine you will start waking up early. If just 30 minutes, 30 minutes early, you know, just to get yourself together for the day. Now, I don't get I don't get dressed or anything until Zari is up. And she while she's eating breakfast, I'm getting myself together. 
that that's what I do. But from 5.30 to 6.30 or from 5.30 to 7 is all about Monica. That's my time. My time. She's sleeping and I'm up. And I love it. <laughs> so, yeah, y'all. I hope you all take these tips, put them in your back pocket, uh, implement them into your routine because it will change your life. It really will. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like and leave me a comment. Um, until next time. Bye, guys.